Welcome to Coop Star Cards. Hey, what's up, Bordo? Hey, Bordo's here, baby. Uh, who do we have here? Uh, Fatina Cabrales or TJ. Okay, what'd you do today, man? Top 16. Top 16. Top 16. What deck was you playing? The My Striker. My Striker. What were your matchups like? Uh, I played some Orcus, Orcus Striker, Striker, Salamangrates. I played a Guru guy. Stuff like that. Okay, okay. Uh, what'd you finish after Swiss? After Swiss, I was 10 and 1. I was undefeated day one. Nice, nice. Okay. All right. Uh, do you have any shout outs you'd like to give? Yeah. Uh, shout out to my girlfriend, Kim. Okay. Uh, shout out to my family. Shout out to Alpaca Games in Fairfield, California. Okay. And BPC and all the Fairfield guys. Okay. All right. Uh, well, without further ado, let's get into the list, man. So, so the only monsters I played was Sky Striker Ray. Best card. Not really much to explain about that. Uh, three engage. Engage was nuts. Like I was like I think a couple games I went like engage into engage, and then like I went upstart into engage. Engage was just crazy. Yeah. And then three area zero. Uh, I was testing two for a little bit, but it didn't make sense when I just wanted a bunch of consistency to the deck. Two shark cannon, and then the one of. This card it was crazy all day. Just uh, being able to kill stuff and then just draw stuff. Mm -hmm. It was nuts. Uh, it came, brought me back into a lot of games. Okay. And that's it for the striker cards. And then for the one ups, terraforming, cyber. Oh universe. yes, yes. I know. I know it's coming. Card this nice. card was really good. Yeah. Just cycling back Kagari, you really snowballed a lot of advantage. Yeah. And just having the extra three hundred was relevant. And then Rota upstart. And then something a little unusual. I was playing at three MST other than uh, rather than Psych Cosmic because I felt like the interaction between this and the field spell when you don't see Ray, it's important to get to Ray regardless. Mm -hmm. And like I forgot, I think it was playing against one of the Salamangri guys. Uh, oh no, it was an Orcus guy where I was able to go engage chain uh, MST target the engage to get the extra draw. Nice, nice. And then three called by stops the ash. You need the uh, engage to go. And then also like when you can like end phase Shizuku to add back, it stops it. And then it also allows this card to go through. Oh, yeah, the card's crazy. Yeah, this card's really good. Um, a lot of people that I've been seeing playing the list, like uh, they just kind of fire it off to like keep adding to the advantage. But I don't think that's correct. I think it's like you want to be able to play your striker cards first. And then once they're able to out that, then you're able to go into this and to rebuild your advantage. Mm -hmm. And that's it for all the spells. And then for the traps, three imperm, three summon limit, and three there can only be one. Oh, wow. Nice, nice. Yeah, I only wanted impactful traps. I tried the compulse. I tried the with lost wind. And those cards are in like, are good but you need to see them in like a conjunction with other traps but it, all these cards can stop a push by themselves like this against orcus like sometimes it's just enough mm -hmm. and then this against most decks is that's it and then salamangrate with this and orcus with this just not really much to explain it but nice, the, nice these cards really won me a lot of games this whole tournament yeah those are 40 cards 40 cards okay Just the standard stuff for, for the links. Okay. And then I played Clan Ruska just in case I played Alter Guys. Uh, I thought that deck would be a little more popular with the Orcus matchup. I didn't want to lose to Village. This card was good, just a lot of Salamangrate. This card's good. This card's good. Um, these two actually helped me out the BLS link to, uh, this today, this tournament. Really strong. I uh, don't know if I made this, and this card was also good. No, all right. And the uh, side, just the gamma seal. It was kind of like a filler. Hanger tops, really strong. Uh, Lancia, system down, and dark ruler, and evenly. I don't think I sided these four in all tournament but these all came in and they're all really good. So if anything, I would change these. But a lot of the, one of the decks that's really popular here was Orchestra Striker. 
And these cards are really good against them. I just just happen to not draw them, I guess. Okay. All right. Uh, is there any other changes that you really like make to the deck now that you're just uh, top 16? Um, I don't know about changes. Not yet. Mm -hmm. I'd have to test more against the Orca Striker deck and then probably build more around that for my sideboard. Other than that, I feel like the main deck was really strong. Okay. And everything was really good. Okay. All right, man. Well, uh, thank you for the profile and congrats on being a top 16, man. Right, thank you. Appreciate it.